What's going on guys, my name is Itempo TV Lee and today we are back in Formcraft 4.1 and we are learning how to do basic infusion or setting up the infusion altar. So first what you want to have is some um, scribing tools and some paper in your inventory. Then click on the infusion on the artifice tab and this will put the research note into your invent. Then put the research notes and the scribing tools back into the research table and you'll get something that looks like this. So there is this one which is Fabrico or Craft, then there is Machina, Mechanism or Machine, and Precatio which is Magic. So Fabrico links to Machina through Instrumentum directly. So if you do this then because I've not got much Instrumentum left I will use Humanus to fill up those two. Uh, and then stick a bestia in between and then Precatio links through air from Machina so Machina can connect to Motus and Motus connects through to air and then air can connect to Aurum Aurum then connects to Precatio and Precatio you can just use, I don't know, Predicio or something to put in between uh, let me find Predicio there you go, so that's completely linked. Uh, so take it out and learn it by right clicking it. This will add it into your former nomicon. Then in the infusion uh, page, it will show you how to make a, infu a runic matrix. So we'll make some of these arcane stone blocks first, quickly. So what you want is a bunch of stone and a bunch of air shards, or any shards really. So set your crafting table up like this uh, sorry like that hold on sorry um, like that and it will cost uh, one terra and one ignis per nine blocks so once you've done that craft them all into these you want a plenty spare at the end of it and then with these you want to put one there one there one there one there an ender pearl in the middle and water shard on either on surrounding it uh, so I'm just going to charge up my wand quickly uh, once you've got the right essentia you can take the runic matrix out and don't worry about that for the moment so next up I'm going to show you how to build the arc the arcane infusion altar. Uh infusion altar, sorry. Um so I've built a little balcony for you guys <laughs> so I can craft it on because it's gonna be a big build. It's uh seven by seven. So create a floor of seven by seven. So that's seven and then one, two, one, two, three. That's seven. Then you wanna make sure it's all filled in. This making it out of this block makes sure it makes sure that it is stable. It um if you've ever done infusion work before you'll know that it's <laughs> it's very hard to keep it stable. So now that you've crafted that little build, you want to create uh, some of these, which are arcane stone bricks. This is to make your pillars. So to make your pillars, you do one there, one there, one there, one there. Put that on there, that on there, that on there, and that on there, I believe. Uh, then that there and there. Let me just go into game mode C quickly. Right. So put your runic matrix into your invent and you want it in the middle but above. So if you do that it should look like this hopefully. Uh, and then with your wand make sure it's got 25 of each uh, essentia. Sorry, I just had to spawn a new wand because mine was didn't have enough viz. So when that's all built like this, hopefully it should 
work. Okay, so apparently not, because I need to actually make the pillars, the pedestal, uh, this time, sorry. So to make the pedestal, you need to make it like this. Um, so it is like three on the bottom, three on the top, one in the middle, stick your wand in to create to use the viz, and uh, there you go, an arcane pedestal. This is what you put, place the items on once you are, once you've crafted it. So like that, and then if I look at my former Nomicon, this is how it's built. So this is the basic mystical construct. So these are to make the pillars. I will just do them quickly. Uh, I think it's there, 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 and there, 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 and there. Does that look right? Do do do. Yep. And then that one there with a gap, and then that, and then hopefully, if with enough fizz, 25 of each. Right click the runic matrix, and boom, there you go. This is the mystical construct. It looks so freaking awesome. So, the point of this is to create very uh, advanced items using Essentia from jars and runic stuff. So, you can upgrade these to runic goggles revealing. They, um, are amazing. They're just great armor. Uh, so in the next episode I will get on to actually making some infusioned stuff. <laughs> so be sure to look out for that. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, I hope you learned a lot from it as well. I'll see you next time. Bye!